Hey everyone, welcome to Houghton's Computer Repair. So I've been told that many people have had a VAST installed and then it's been running down your computer and it's been running sluggish. So you need to try to uninstall it by going to pretty much going to settings, then apps, and somehow it's missing. I choose the wrong thing. There you go, apps and features, and a VAST is missing. Or let's say if you try to go to control panel by going to that location by typing control panel and here it comes up I'm going to programs and Avast doesn't want to uninstall it or it's missing too so then you try the third option by going to Avast and using their removal tool and it wants to go into safe mode or if not it wants to try and do it physically there without going in safe mode and it's still having problems well I'm going to be showing you how you can fix this problem by uninstalling Avast using Revo Uninstaller if you have not installed Revo Uninstallers, I will go ahead and give the link and I also have another video that shows you how to install Revo Uninstaller. So let's go ahead and get started. So if you already have Revo Uninstaller installed, you would probably need to get it if you don't. And go ahead and open up the program. And it'll probably prompt you for this, so I'll go ahead and press yes. And once Revo Uninstaller comes up, you have a list of all different types of programs. And the one that we're going to look for is Avast. Avast right there is 1.13 gigabytes right now. What you do is you go ahead and choose it and prompt it. And it tells if you want to uninstall it. So it pretty much opens up the program for Avast to uninstall it. If it doesn't go through this, you can still continue and I'll find the files. But for the time being, just press uninstall. And it's asking, are you sure if you want to uninstall it? I'm saying yes. If you're going to reinstall it, I'm going to press uninstalling. You really don't even have to do this, you can just skip this if you want to. And there's prompting me. Regardless, let it continue uninstalling if it's there. If it doesn't come to this point, again, you'll be able to find all the settings from it from Rebel Uninstaller. And I'll be showing that right now. So if you want to restart the computer, I'm going to just go ahead and just press the restart later. After that you have an option here if you want to choose a safe scanning, moderate, or an advanced. I'm going to enable the advanced so I'll be sure it will get everything from Avast. You'll then choose scan after that and let it do its work. And right here it found all different files from registry. I'll actually use it for exe files underneath the registry. I'm going to go ahead and choose everything. Or you have the option right here select all select 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 and I'm gonna go ahead and delete those files and yes and then here's all of these additional files all here there's a lot from executable files to DLLs to folders to all different stuff I'm gonna go ahead and press select all from a vast to to all be selected and delete them And then it tells you selected, but selected, but remaining files will be deleted during the next system restart. I'm gonna go ahead and press OK. And there's additional files here that I found. I'm gonna go ahead and press delete those files too. Are you sure you want to delete the selected items? Yes, I do. Now it tells us that they're remaining until during the next system restart. So I'm gonna go ahead and press finish. For the time being, I am pretty much sure that Avast is already gone. But to be sure, I'm going to go ahead and restart this computer. And here it comes with an update. I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and do its work and I'll be back on the video as soon as it finishes. All right, here's my computer loading back up and let it continue doing that. What do I have in the recycle bin? All the files that were there from Avast, I'm going to go ahead and empty them. Select all and I am going to delete them for sure so they'll all be gone and I'll prompt me I'm gonna press all and delete them and it seems that everything's out of my recycle bin I do not see a vast here I do not see the shortcut here I don't see it in the start menu at all I'm gonna go ahead and go to settings and go to apps. I don't see a vast there either. And I'm also going to check just to be sure to show you 
by going to control panel. Sorry about that. You kind of hear a train in the back of it comes there. You're going to go to programs and check if there's any programs in that feature. And I do not see a vast. But it's so it's pretty much been gone. Thanks for watching from Houghton's Computer Repair, and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. If you just like this video, then hit that button. But if you like it and you want to see more, hit that like button. Get subscribed, comment, and tell us what other tech videos you want to see. Consider checking out our merch store. Link in the video description. And for the rest, I will see you on the next video.